I lied. And we went over that in my last video. Although one thing we didn't go over was that I made a mistake. Oh wait, we went over that, didn't we? Yes, we did. That's not what this video is about. This video is about what's coming this Friday. Yeah, that's right. This Friday, we're getting an actual update. I'm not lying this time. Meaning that whatever I said last week is all part of the plan. What plan, you may ask? I have no sensible idea. And I also don't know why I'm heading down to caves right now. But I guess that's a good time to say that um, everything Pride relevant is going to be officially leaving. Yeah, so if you have been, like, really sad that it's that it's leaving, then comment down below if you're happy that it's leaving and you're just hype for the next update. Then also comment down below, and the secret word will be coming up later in the video. So get prepared for that, get ready for the update, and I'll be informing you everything that's going to be leaving, as well as some predictions as to what's coming. Without further ado, well, let's get into it. Whee! One thing that we are all very certain will not be leaving is the new Stump revamp. For those of you who do not know, Stump got a revamp with the new Wild West and Wild Wet, whatever the new flashback is, it got revamped. So now when you spawn in, you spawn in on this hay bale thing. The computer and game mode changer is over here. And later in the video, I'll be talking about a new game mode coming. As well as the mess of the day being over here next to the subscribe button. And the girl take code of conduct is closer to the cosmetic changer, which I think it is a well-deserved revamp. It is actually a very good use of space before they just had the cosmetic thing here the game changer and computer here but it almost feels like a bigger stump now even though they haven't done a single thing to change it just orientate things differently girl tag if you're watching great job now let's get on to the pride stuff i already said it in the beginning of the video but basically what i said is all the pride decorations as well as cosmetics are going to be leaving so that means these pride balloon things are going to be leaving i don't think that's even part of the pride update maybe it is but you just throw balloons at people uh the pride all of these cosmetics right here everything in the shop will be leaving so pick up a pride flag or whatever while, while you while you're at it which i don't think any of you guys are going to be doing because because most of my viewers say that they don't like Pride Update anyways, so it's totally up to you though. Except for this thing. I don't like furs in this game, okay? I don't like furries. I mean furs. <laughs> Sorry about that. I had to I had to do it. And you know what I just realized? Even though I'm an update YouTuber, I didn't even cover this. They added a balloon in the balloon shop. It's not a new balloon, although it's pretty cool that they added a balloon in the actual shop it's meant to be in. It's the um the the sun the sun yeah, the, here comes the sun balloon. and it's from the last year's beach update. So yeah, cool. One thing I don't know about for sure though is whether they remove this stage or not. They probably will just to make room for other updates, but this is part of the pride update, so I'm assuming it'll be leaving. Until this day, we have not had a single rocket launch. The secret word for today's video is rocket because I feel like this rocket will never ever launch one of my videos until the space update comes out. Yeah, I'm still thinking about that, but although this video is not about that, don't worry. The pride decorations in forest, beach, tutorial question mark? Nope, tutorial has no decorations, but the one thing in tutorial will be leaving, canyons, and in caves, clouds, mountains, although mountains has like almost no decorations for Pride Update, a single decoration, I'll show you. This one, and that's all I really want to apply to and show you. All, basically every single map with decorations in it is completely getting rid of them. I said that like three times. Oh yeah, and city. Now the flashback items will most likely be staying for one more week, although the item shop with the Pride Jam cosmetics will have a new item shop, and I'm thinking it's gonna be something horror related. Something to do with perhaps a horror mode, perhaps, perhaps, perhaps? Uh, if my, um, if my, if my conclusions are correct. Also, my Discord server, the one I always talk about in my videos, will be getting an update very soon. It's going to be the self-promo update. So if you ever wanted to self-promo your YouTube channel and get it out there for people to know or your Twitch or whatever you guys do for in your free time, self-promo it. We're going to have a section soon, but you have to join it if you want to do that. So join it down below. My Discord is always linked in the description. Thanks, guys. So as you guys know, Caves is a historically great map, but that's not really what I'm thinking of right now. I'm thinking of the thing under Caves, which is the connected map, is Mines. And in Mines, last Friday, we in fact got- actually, be wait, would that be two fridays ago now no just just last friday sorry i'm tripping but last friday we got the secret map edition which entering it brings you to a cage two cage doors that you have to unlock with a key card so if you grab the key card you'll be able to get in just let me do that real quick in my previous videos i've covered this many times but it's a monkey with a mask and red ink on it it's not blood we all know it's not blood and it says no 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 now this is what you got to get to scan here then it's a decontamination chamber so you have to wait for that to open then close it and then we can open this side the door is open Woo! inside of the main room Room, well, the main compartment room when you first get in is a bunch of different things. The most important of which being the ghost reactor. Currently, the ghost reactor is offline, which means right now it is dormant and there is no ghost in the main maze over there. Although it is ending very, very soon and we have to prepare. And an official t leak from TTT Pig on screen confirms that in the next update, we're going to be getting a new ghost that is going to chase us around and swallow us. Well, probably not swallow us, but like eat us because it's a ghost and ghosts like to eat. 
children for dinner. So watch out, kids, because you're going to have to get prepared for this game. So right now, this is just a preparation update. So it gives us the map. And so you guys can explore and try figuring out everything. So there's these gates. This will open and close the gates. So this, that button just open this or close this gate. And all these buttons open and close different gates. Right now, you can't summon the ghost because it's a dormancy period. But next up that you will be able to. So they're making a whole separate update just for the ghost alone. So that's going to be really cool. I'm assuming what that means is that there's going to be a ghost running around and we have to try and escape it. Although right now, there is not a whole lot to do in this map because like I said, there's no ghost. So it's just a bunch of a straight obstacle and an exact replica of mines without the exact same exits because where exits are, there's just dead ends. The place where you usually spawn like the ghost on the upper side of mines, which people are calling like the skeleton ghost is it's just a dark space. And that's where I think the ghost is going to spawn. That's why I'm going to get out of here because I, I don't I don't want the ghost to spawn on me. Oh yeah, I think that'd be cool. See a new, you know, a new ghost and stuff. Also, people are saying they've already seen the ghost. It's apparently like a red ghost that chases you around. There's also, apparently people said in my first video of the update, there was a jump scare in it. I didn't put that there, so there was. Maybe maybe there's jump scares every once in a while. Maybe behind me? No, just the entrance or, or an exit. But now I think it's time to go into a lobby, disguised as somebody so they don't recognize me, and see what they think what the next update's gonna be, because that's all I ever ask people. It's a good question though. Let's go. Oh, and one more thing. For cosmetics, I think they're gonna add like really cool ghost hand cosmetics, like maybe Ghostbuster cosmetics, like a gun, ghost gun, ghost stuff. Yeah, horror cosmetics is what I was mostly thinking. So not quite Halloween, like not costumes, but I was thinking like more horror related cosmetics for this update. And hopefully the next update after that will be a summer update. And for a final prediction, I think for sure there'll be a ghost. So that means a secret map will technically change in their technical minds. Although Gorilla takes the type of game to just spice things up and literally add a summer update. So I imagine if they just this Friday, summer update and a ghost hunting mode, dude, that'd be the best update combination ever. Let's get into it. We are now bacon and I look like bacon. Hopefully no one cooks me. Literally, that, that was so funny. Um, what the Sigma? Please. Guys, guys, do you hear me? Guys. Green, let me in. Come on, guys. Oh, cool. Um, the password is new tour the goat. Yes! Bye bye. Womp womp. Alright, my question is is there a ghost yet in here? Where's the ghost, guys? What the sick? I love your eyes, bro. Alright, I'm going in alone this time. Well, this is anticlimactic. Ow! <laughs> yeah, I made it. Okay, no one is responsive in this map for some reason, so it's time to go to 